ready. I'm ready to share the Trinity now. Uh, there's a couple of different ways to tie it in the beginning. I think I sh I'm showing you the best way, but you might have to play with it a little bit. This is the first two. The first two moves can be a little different. I go around and then in and then through. It's hard to explain. Why don't you watch this video, and then I'll get back to it and I'll show you some variations. The Trinity, like the Eldridge, is tied with the little end. So get your big end all organized on your belly button, the way you want it, the length. Maybe, you know what, do go a little bit shorter than your belly button because you will pull it down when you tighten it. So a little bit higher, but you'll get that with practice. Go around and then go up through the top. Then go around the same side, okay? See, it's like a, like a, like a spiral. Then go around the back. And do this little double, okay, you got this? Now this part, keep it very loose. Keep it all very, very loose. You're gonna go through the bottom. This is a little tricky here. Here, you're gonna go around the back and then up through that loop. You can already kind of see it coming together, see that? There we go. Very loose, see how loose I am? It's a very loose knot. And then on through the back. And there you go. Tighten it up. Put your collar down, and that is the Trinity. This is one of my favorites. This is a great looking knot. I love it. Everybody notices it, and it's like, oh, that's really cool. How do you do that? Now you know how to do it. So let's see some of these. Enjoy. Okay. So you saw one version of it. This is kind of a small screen now. I mean, a small, uh, I mean, low quality, and you're far away, but. It shouldn't be too big of a deal. This is just four variations. So, as you can see, this is a knot I tied on, on the camera there. So what I did here is I went around, and then I went around the back right now. Okay, let's do it a different way. Now I'm gonna go around, and then instead of going around this way, go around this way, and then you do the same thing. We just reverse directions. It puts it, it changes what, what side the bigger side the bigger uh, tie is on, and then it makes it a little bit different when you do it. I feel like doing it the way I showed you makes a more round knot. But also with you can just go around, and then instead of going around again, you just go right into the actual the actual Trinity tying, you know, like this. Uh, that's that sometimes works for m much. Uh, thinner ties. If your tie is very light and airy, then this that version might be better. And I can't even, I don't have a mirror, so I don't know what this is looking like, but there are different ways to start, and the end is always the same. So, there's a really cool knot. I'm a big supporter of it. You know, what's cool about it is if you tie it with a striped tie, which I have yet to do, but I've done it as a practice sometimes, with diagonal stripes, the center can end up having all the stripes going into it, which looks cool, or it'll be like a triangle, which also looks cool. So with a striped tie, this not to look really neat, but you gotta make sure you do it right. So I hope that was helpful. You guys enjoy wearing this and you know, tweet it to me. I wanna see pictures.